All right, so <clears throat> time for another exciting episode of League of Legends. Um, so my first video was dealing with ADC and Sivir, and as luck would have it, my second video is going to be a uh, a uh, a sequel to that. And you know what? All sequels need a good name, and I've been thinking the the, the okay. Hear me out, okay? The Civtastic Adventures. The Civtastic Adventures. Yeah, it's awful. I know. We'll we'll come back to that. Anyways, um, so yeah, going back to Civ as an ADC. Um, this is gonna be a fairly unique game in that we're running a kill lane bottom with Sivir and Annie. Now, I have seen support Annie in the past. It has been mixed results. I think she has the potential to do really well though because she has that on-demand stun. She also has a fair amount of burst as well. Um, we're against a Vayne and an Arcade Sona. Obviously, I think, or well, not an Arcade Sona, Sona, but I think Sona's a better support than Annie. Um, but Annie's not really a support so much as a kill lane. Vayne, I think, is a better ADC than Sivir, so this will be hilarious. Um, basically, what our goal is going to be is to go balls to the walls aggression. Um, if you have not seen my uh, previous Sivir video, um, there will be a link in the description. Uh, basically, I just went over what I was doing in that game. Uh, I'll reiterate some of it here. I'm going with um, the same masteries as before, same skill setup, pretty much the same item setup as well. Um, I recommend watching that video. Uh, it saves me the effort of going over it all again. Um, since I don't have to go over it all again, I'll probably mostly just be talking, um, which will be interesting because I'm not really, I, 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 I'm not a great speaker, I think, um, I guess something I could talk about is, like, the other lane matchups, like, we have, we have our Fiora against, um, against Aatrox, uh, that could go either way, it depends on their skill levels, I think. I think Fiora is slightly better than Aatrox to a degree, but I think Aatrox does bring a bit more to the table as well as far as team fights. We have Lysander against Mordekaiser. I love Mordekaiser. I have mixed opinions on Lysandra. I've never really seen a good Lysandra, so it's hard for me to really um, really comment on it. I would assume Mordekaiser is better. Mordekaiser tends to beat out most mids. Um, unless they have some form of really hard CC to stop him. So, we're hitting off bottom here, starting with my boomerang blade again. Um, we're probably going to try and pick up an early kill on Sona, more than likely, but we might get it on Vayne. So, <laughs> um, sorry, I'm just kind of laughing at our, our Annie's name, which is um, pretty funny, I think, at least. But anyways, funny in that it's so simple, but um. So, looking at our team comp right now, um, we have a fair amount of CC. We're kind of squishy. We don't have, like, most of our team isn't beast, beast um, For the honor. Minions have uh, not beefy. Like, most of our team's not beefy. We're kind of squishy. But we do have Not with his CC, and we do have some CC from Annie as well as Lysandra. Um, looking at their team, they're, they're really not that beefy. Like, they're not really too beefy either. Um, you have Zack who's going to be beefy, but then Mord's a little beefy and so is Aatrox, but they're not like super beefy. Um, but they're they're kind of CC light, I th well, they have about as much CC I'd say as us, because they do have the Sonal and they do have the Zack ult, but outside of that they really don't have anything aside from Dark Flight, which is pretty nasty. So... Basically, yeah, job at ADC, just sit here and get farmed. Mm. 
managed to chunk both of them with my boomerang blade, which is always nice. So, you know, I mentioned last time, one of the downsides of Sivir is the fact that she has such a sword attack range. Because you'll notice here that I have to be, like, really in the fray. Hit Sona with both, um... Both the in and the out of my boomerang blade. Boom. Oh, almost got the vein. So, we're playing really aggressive, which means the lane's going to be pushed hard. So, we got to be we we've got to be really careful about jungle ganks. Now, the good thing is Annie um Annie is doing really well like she is really putting on the aggression like she isn't skipping out on it at all. And there's the first blood, yeah! Good job, Annie. We, we should let her know. So we'll grab another point in our boomerang blade. Um, we'll boom. That'll get us a hit on Bane there. Ooh. We're fine now. We're fine, we're fine and dandy like cotton candy. Oh god, why did I say that? Anyways, um... So yeah, we'll just sit back while Annie zones the, uh, vein. Um, a little concern I have is when Sona gets sick, she'll have her ult, but then, to be honest, Annie will be able to respond with a tibbers to the face. She'll just be like, hey there, Sona, how you doing? And then Sona's just gonna be like, um, I'm doing fine. Actually, no, Sona's not gonna say anything, because Sona's mute. She'll just be like, dot dot dot. And then Annie will just be like, hey. And then she'll, like, whip it out. She'll just whip out her tibbers, her, her bare tibbers. And, it, well, I mean, it'll just be out there. Like, there's not gonna be anything we can really do about it. It'll just be, it'll be out. And, yeah. It'll be on full display. And I mean, I'm sure the shock of it will just, uh, it'll, it'll just stun them. Yep. Oh god. <laughs> Anyways. <laughs> if you don't hear from me, probably because the internet police got me. So, I'm gonna... I'm gonna hit B. I'm kinda low on health and mana. And I have a ton of money to spend. Um, so... I can't quite get um, my BF sword, so I'm gonna, gonna opt for Vamp Scepter and Boots. I could get Pots, I really don't need it though, being able to just uh, life still up. So on my way back to lane, um, so yeah, like like I was saying, the concern is the Tassona alt, but really, we have a good response with it, uh, to it rather, with the Annie alt. And that's going to give me free DPS time and basically going to give me a free boomerang blade on them. And if you've noticed the anti stun so far, the boomerang blade is basically... It's being a killer, like it's causing a lot of problems for them. Didn't hit anything with that. Auto attack these. So Nautilus is going in. Got us a Sona. Annie got the stun, I think, on the vein. Unfortunately, I'm slow as hell and I have that short attack range. <sighs> I'm dreadful. Annie go and drop another ward. Very good, because we're going to be pushing hard. It's just the nature of our lane. And Sona going to counter ward. Um, that was weird. I'm not really sure why Zach didn't follow up when I got stunned, but... Um, 
Um, looks like they're going to take his blue. Let's keep an eye on that. So, <laughs> intense boss battle there, so I went a bit quiet. Um, <laughs> Vayne got greedy there and then walked right into the boomerang blade for the kill. We'll grab Zerk Greaves and then head back to lane. Um, so yeah, I'm going, I'm basically following the same build, grab my Vamp Scepter and my Zerk Greaves and I'm going to go into a Bloodthirster. Um, Lysander doing some major work mid, which is nice. Fiora doing work top. Uh, Fiora definitely was smart not going in on that because he has his passive up. Not keeping the lane pushed down bottom, not sure how I feel about that yet. We're not quite able to get Sona there, partially because I whiffed my boomerang blade fairly badly. Gonna drop the tower though, which is always a nice thing. Zach's top, so we're completely safe. I'd like to point out that I love people when they call the jung like when the jungler somewhere, so it basically says, hey, you're free to do what you need to do. Um, we don't quite have enough for the 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 the, the, the BF sword, which sucks. So we'll go here and grab red. Mord seems pretty um, flabbergasted about Lissandra right now. Ooh. Um. Fiora DC'd and Aatrox shut her down. To be fair, Fiora is the worst champion in League of Legends, though, so. No, not really. But. Sucks that she DC'd and got shut down, because that's extra gold for Aatrox. Got red buff, which is nice. I have enough for my BF sword, but I'd rather not go back until I have to, so. Another double kill bottom. <laughs> or not a double kill, I got a kill and an assist, so. So I'm snowballing pretty hard. Um, our kill lane's definitely working out well, and I'm liking it. Boom. And now we'll back off. Annie very good with her tibbers, putting it in the bush there in case someone decided to come in. Mm 
<laughs> oh, Annie. Annie being silly. So, yeah, I'm snowballing pretty hard, which means this will probably be an easy game. I'm gonna head top and watch that, though. Ooh, the Sandra got shut down. That's never a good thing. Yeah, and he's saying that they hope Fiora comes back, which I definitely hope Fiora comes back too. Uh, speaking of the devil, Fiora came back! Let's put some major pressure on top. Ouch. Definitely... I thought I could take him, I thought I had the sustain, I didn't. Um... <laughs> Looks like Not made a bad decision not going on Aatrox when he did. Uh, Zach's top, but we have Fiora coming in. Fiora hopefully can clean up. That would be my hope. Uh, we'll grab Bloodthirster. And down bottom to farm it up. Fiora not going to be able to pick up the kill on Zach because of the tower. Ooh, Lissandra picking up kills and doing work. That's great. So. That was a really bad decision on my part to go in on Aatrox there. Uh, I really should have known that I wasn't going to get him, but I thought, I thought, I thought I'd be able to. Um, I thought wrong, obviously, but... Live and learn, live and learn. So we'll grab, uh, Ricochet, max up Ricochet again, second, instead of the shield. Doing that for the extra pushing power and damage. Um, <laughs> Annie asking uh, about me recording. Fiora doesn't seem happy about uh, <laughs> being recorded. <laughs> mm. Alright, so going back bottom here. Uh, they're doing dragon, and people are going in on dragon. I'm gonna go and see if I'm giving them a hand. More just melt it. Got both the Sona and the Vein. Uh, looks like we cleaned up actually. Uh, minus the Zack that got away. Throw another rank in our ulti. Probably gonna drop to uh, mid tower here. Um, looks like they got the dragon though, which sucks, but. Uh, we got the tower. We got tower and four kills, so it's definitely worth it. Um, interesting thing about dragon is dragon is worth it if no more than two people die, interestingly enough. As soon as you have two people die, the gold isn't worth it anymore. Sona eating, um... Honor, 
Save the Annie. No, Annie. I tr I tried to save the Annie. I I really did. Annie, no. As you can tell, Mord really. Um. Well. <laughs> We'll drop the so yeah I might have died but like we cleaned up perfectly fine I'm, I'm fine with this Um, just talking about skins in chat, apparently. Oh. Yeah, so yeah, anyways, F Fiora uh, saying that, like, Bandit Sibber has a really bad art but looks good in game. Definitely true. There's a few skins like that, but... Where the art really... Doesn't do them justice, I think. Sandstorm Cat, yeah, that's another skin. They are actually, I like the art for Sandstorm, and then the in game looks eh. So here we are, um, Fiora stomping through the top, going to give her a hand. Our Fiora just doing, like, ridiculously good. Oh, but shut down. BAM! <laughs> and then Fiora faking a rage quit. Um, uh, the the unfortunate thing is once people realize that they're going on the YouTube's, um, you know that hip thing with the kids and stuff, they really become a little bit less funny. I think. Um. So we'll just drop this. Oh, Aatrox being a dick. We can drop him too. Grab our... Phantom Dancer. So we'll hit bottom to farm up. <laughs> I'm worried now that, that these people are aware of my existence so they're gonna come watch these videos, which I don't know if they're gonna find them as entertaining as uh as um, they're hoping. I, like I said, I want to do more informative, so... Not to say that there won't be funny stuff. Um, I'm already thinking about doing a couple uh, comp uh, compilations of just some silly stuff that's happened throughout the day. I had a lot of really bad games, but like, there's been a couple really funny things in them. I mean, an example of something funny from this game is the fact that when Sona, uh, Vane was going in, and trying to get our Annie, and then she just walks into that Pokemon Blade. It's just like... Yeah, I, I found that funny. I don't know if everyone would, but...
Oh my god, Zach, no! Not gonna kill me. Not gonna kill me. Fuck you, Mord! <laughs> oh god, that was so close. And down goes the Mord. Alright, so we got our Phantom Answer, we got our Bloodthirster. Um, I really don't feel like I need the defensive items, so... I think it's, uh, I think it's time for an Affinity Edge. Uh, I think I'm gonna hold off though until I can get the BF sword. So. Go back mid. Well, Fjord's going to so actually, yeah, we'll be fine to go back mid. An enemy has been slain. At this point, we've pretty much won. I feel like we're kind of just dicking around. Um, if we really pushed, I think we'd win. Uh, I'm gonna go grab this dragon because why not? Basically, free gold, so. With Sandra being chased. And then going in the double kill. Oh, Lysandra, you're crazy. I gotta say, first Lysandra I've seen that's a little bit frightening, actually. Get us an inhibitor. Uh, if you're pushing the tower top. And bam, more kills. <laughs> oh, poor Zach. Sometimes leak chat really amuses me a lot. Our BF sword and our agility cloak, so that'll give us uh, some more crit as well. Grab our red and then go mid. So, Sibber seen some play at LCS, which was interesting. Didn't win, but interesting nonetheless to see her actually getting use. <laughs> oh, Lysandra, you and your triple kills, you were just so silly. Um, they're kind of blaming Zack for all their problems, which I, I don't think it's really Zack because I don't think he put enough pressure on lanes at all, but on the same note, I don't think he really could. Like, all the lanes were doing really bad, unfortunately. And that is good game. 
hope you enjoyed the Sintastic Adventures um, <laughs> sequel. Not really a sequel, the sequel is the Sintastic Adventures. You know what, I'm just gonna quit while I'm ahead, and I will see you all next time. See ya. Or, see ya. <laughs> Some